So it's May 2025 and you're now looking for a single toolbox to manage all of your Fi Sticks, Fi TVs, as well as your Android TV devices. Maybe you're looking for a solution to push applications with one click, to install multiple applications with one click, the ability to back up your entire care application, add-ons, custom builds, all of them can be backed up with one click and you can then go ahead and push that onto other devices but you also want the ability to stop all of your background applications with one click. Well, what if I told you this tool is available right now? It's absolutely free. And with it, you can now fully manage all of your streaming devices with one click. All you need to do is just hit that like button, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, let's get started. If you're new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. So the application in question for your Android devices is called Easy Fire Tools, and you'll see this available directly on the Google Play Store. So if you have an Android phone or an Android tablet, you can install this application. And with this single application, you really can fully load, fully manage your Amazon or Android TV device. Let me just turn on my Android tablet and we can see here, this is what the application looks like. So easy fire tools, let's click on that. And of course in the background, you guys can see my fire TV cube. And because easy fire tools uses ADB, any device that you can enable ADB debugging on, you can use this application. And when you start the application, the first thing it does is it shows you all of the applications installed on your Android device. So here we can see I've got some streaming applications, we got a screen server application. And the benefit of that is you can basically see the applications you have on your Android phone or Android tablet. And then with one click, you can then push the same app directly onto your Fire Stick or Amazon device. Now, before you do anything, the first thing you need to do is make a connection from Easy Fire Tools over to your device. You can click on this icon here. This now scans all of the devices on my home network. And I think my current third gen cube is this one here. Let's click on that. So that's now selected. And I can now click on the connect button on the top right. Now the first time you do this, you should see an ADB prompt exactly like that. So on my device now I can click on always allow and click on okay. And if I do continue now, we can see that's now connected. So I now have made an ADB connection from easy fire tools directly onto my third gen cube. And that's pretty much it guys. So now that we made that connection, the first thing I can do is anything that I've installed on my Android tablet, anything I click on will now automatically be pushed over to my third gen cube. So here, for example, we can see uh, aerial views. So if I click on that, so do you want to install this? I can click on yes. That now automatically pushes the application to my Fire TV cube. It begins the installation process and in a couple of seconds, and we then get the pop-up. So that just confirms the application was installed properly. And it really is as easy as that, guys. So anything you have installed here, you can push. Or for example, I can go to custom APK file. I can select a file. So anything I have on my phone now, anything I've downloaded from my website or from somebody else's website, you can click on the app and that will then push that directly over to your whichever device you're connected to. Now, one of the other great features with this application is the ability to close down foreground running tasks. So not background tasks, but stuff running in the foreground, you can now close them down with one click. Now, as you can see here, when I click on the hamburger menu again, let's click on where it says task manager. And it now shows me there's four things running in the foreground. So I can see one of them is my VPN client. One of them is the care application and a couple other things. And if I want to close all these down to free up some memory, I can now click on the cross here on the bottom left. Let's click on that now. So you want to close all these applications, click on okay. And just like that, it says all of those foreground tasks are now closed. So I would just say one more time that this is not background running applications. The kind of stuff that my TD UK app killer closes this is only for foreground tasks running in the foreground. You can now quickly close them with one click using easy fire tools. Now, before we continue, let me just quickly share this QR code that if you are looking for a fantastic offer for a ridiculously fast VPN, stay safe online, change your IP address, access geo-locked content, protect your privacy, you definitely wanna go ahead and scan this QR code for a superb discount. Then we have the media center. So as I mentioned at the start of this video, 
I can now just click on this drop down box here and with one click now I can push any of these versions directly over to my connected device. So no need to go over to downloader or type in different codes through the single application we can push any version of the care application directly over to our connected device. We can do that. We can also change the advanced settings. So the people that regularly use the care application may know about some of these settings where you can adjust the buffer size, the cache memory size, even the timeout. So these typically require you to edit an XML file. But again, with easy fire tools, we can make those advanced changes just by selecting them here and then writing them over to our connected device. And lastly, we have the big backup. So literally with one click, I can select backup and I can now back up my entire configuration, my entire build, all of my favorite add-ons. All of that can be copied over with one click inside Easy Fire Tools. Once you've done that, you can then make another connection to your new device and then just restore that same build. So super easy. And it's a very common question that people ask that, how can I quickly back up my care application so I can then install the same build onto multiple devices? Well, all of that is built directly inside Easy Fire Tools. So great feature here. You also have a file manager. So if you want to manipulate the files on your Fire Stick, if you want to copy something over, if you want to download something from your device, all of that is available inside the file manager. At the bottom here, we have the options to take a screenshot which will take a screenshot of your Fire Stick wherever you have on the screen. That's now saved into gallery. So if I now go back to my file manager, go to the Easy Tools folder, and there we can see the screen. So overall guys, I really am impressed with this updated version of Easy Fire Tools. Great features, as you've seen today, the ability to install applications, multiple applications, the ability to close down your foreground tasks with one click. Now the ability to push out the care application or to back up the care application, was actually removed from the latest version of this application due to some requirement from Google. So if you're looking for the slightly older version, which does give you the ability where you can back up all of your care application, your builds, your add-ons, all with one click, I will leave that custom version or that slightly older version directly onto my website. Just go to techdoctoruk.com, go to tutorials, and the latest tutorial in the list will be how you can get this other version of Easy Fire Tools. And also just to mention that if you are looking for the best way to stay safe online, change your IP address, access geolocked content, really just give you the best streaming experience. Right now, there's a super special offer just for the next two weeks where you can get total protection for all of your devices, all of your applications, your add-ons, your APKs, your streaming apps, all of them can be covered with the VPN and they also give you unlimited connections. What that means is it doesn't matter if you've got three Fire Sticks, 10 Android TVs, two laptops, all of those devices, unlimited devices, will be covered with a single license. You get blazing fast speeds, so zero buffering, and they also have a verified no logs policy. So they're not logging anything, they're not monitoring anything. You really can stay anonymous whilst using this VPN. You can access all of your favorite applications, your Netflixes, your BBC iPlayers, your Hulus. All of your streaming applications can be unlocked by using this VPN. And to get all of that for just over $2 a month, I do think this special offer is definitely worthwhile checking out. Using my link does help support the channel, so many thanks for doing that. Do have a look in the video description and pinned comment if you want to take up this special offer. So really appreciate your support. Do like and share this video, and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.